all right well, welcome back everybody it has been a while <laughs> it's uh it's been an interesting couple of months between the coronavirus shutting down pretty much all my ramps other than a few um at least all the popular spots that i like to go getting hit by a tornado <laughs> and a few other things in life uh yeah i haven't been fishing it's been probably a month and a half two months so not what i was expecting for spring i thought for sure i'd be down here doing this a whole lot more but that's the way life goes. So just been working around our property a lot. So if you're into those kind of videos, we do have that other YouTube channel. Links in the description. But it's time to get back to fishing. It is a beautiful morning. Got down here just a little after daylight. So I've got recording light. And uh, we're going to do something that's still new to me. So we're going to take out my lifetime Teton uh, angler here. And we're going to try a little more kayak fishing. So this is still new to me. I'm still learning. But uh, I bought it just for places like this that I just cannot get a boat in. Ramps in too rough shape. Normally it's even lower here and it's nothing but rocks all across the river. So I have never fished up this part of the river before. It's a bit swift here. So I'm going to drag the kayak up past all the swift water. And then uh, we're going to go see what we can find. And we're off. A lot of cool mornings for May. It was in the 40s coming down this morning, which is quite cool for Florida. I don't know if that's going to mess them up for topwater fishing. But if you followed the channel for a while, you know me. I got to fish with the Whopper Plopper for a little bit. Just love throwing this bait. Now I got to get used to throwing it sitting down in a kayak. So used to standing up in a boat my whole life. Oh, look at there. All right. Might have been old Brim swatting at it, but it's nice to nice to see some action this morning. Tell you what, it sure is beautiful out here. Just listen to this.
All right, I know some of y'all are watching this because you're curious about this kayak. Like I said, it's a Lifetime Teton Angler's 10-foot kayak. And uh, it's my first kayak ever, but I can tell you it feels very stable. I don't feel like I'm going to tip out of here by no means. I don't know that I'll be standing up in it, although I think you could, but uh, I don't recommend it. Definitely doesn't feel that stable, but uh, leaning in or out, you know, moving my hands around, setting the hook on the fish, this thing feels good. And I, I got it for $349, and I've seen them on sale as much as $329. That's hard to beat, especially being that this has a real seat in it, you know, lifted seat that was important to me. No matter what kayak I got, I knew I wanted some sort of elevated seat. Sitting on them little foam pads is not going to work for this guy. Man, it's beautiful out here. Feels perfect, too. Now we're talking. Oh, yeah, now we're talking. That's a good one. That is a good one, especially on a beetle spin. Ooh, look at here. So, I think that'll be at least 54 inches long. Let's put her back. There you go, girl. Watch her swim off, watch. She gone. All jokes aside, I'm having a good morning. Like I always say, fishing or catching fish, that's that's the bonus. Being out here is what I'm here for. Alright. My first set of rapids with a kayak. Pretty fun. This is where I started this morning, but I'm gonna go on down river a little ways. Oh, I decided to re-rig. Surprisingly, even the brim are not biting. So I'm going to go with the old green pumpkin here. Uh, trick worm. Love these things. Old good standby right here for me over the years. Well, look at that old big, beautiful cypress. be a bass hanging around that thing right there. Oh, yes there is. Dang. Oh, he pulling some drag. Might not be. Oh no. Oh, he got off. There go, man. That thing was pulling drag. <sighs> Dang it. Well, y'all, I think I'm going to call it a day. It's been an extremely slow day of fishing. I just don't get it. Maybe it's just all these cool mornings. With that said, I'm still going to post this video. Obviously, you're watching it because what a beautiful day. I hate to not post this. Beautiful river, birds chirping. It feels perfect. It's got to be in the 60s right now. I just I love this. The old uh, Lifetime Teton is doing very well. I 
works. I feel very stable and sturdy in it. I'm uh, probably going to do another video here before long showing me modify this. Now that I've been out in it a few times, there's some things that I definitely want to do to the kayak. So I'll be, uh, I'll be releasing a video here pretty soon showing me just doing a couple minor modifications. But I think one of them will really help increase the comfort on the river all day. So thank y'all so much for watching. I'll try to get out and do an actual catching fish video soon. But that's why they call it fishing, not catching. <laughs>